I wanted to give you a look at our allergy forecast as well. Mold, the highest number it's been in four years. 17,000, very high. Robert, really, the wheat rains from this last weekend just didn't help people who suffer from mold allergies. Mold, of course, loves the moisture. And it loves the wind, too. This afternoon, I spoke with Austin allergist Dr. Thomas Leith about that. We counted uh, approximately 17,000 spores per, per cubic meter today. And how does that compare to a normal day? Um, we've been averaging over the last few weeks one to 2,000 per day, approximately. So it's, it's a significant spike. What do you attribute the spike to? Most likely the, the recent uh, severe thunderstorm we had this weekend and probably a little bit exacerbated by the nice warm weather that heated things up yesterday. How long do you expect that high count to continue? I expect to see it drop relatively quickly in the next couple of days. And what are the symptoms for folks with mold? A lot of people can get just really congested or sneezing or uh, just feel crummy in general. Um, for our asthmatic patients, this can really trigger their asthma symptoms. Dr. Lee told me allergy sufferers should take their medications consistently. You shouldn't stop taking them just because you don't have any allergy symptoms.